Drill Tech partnered with OJA to design, engineer, and manufacture all the truss driver machines in operation today. We're out here in Mountain House, Nevada, one of Drill Tech's new locations. This is where we take care of our truss driver machines. This is where it all started here. These are our TD2 machines that we worked with with Ojo to build and design. Uh, we did a lot of R&D on these machines. TD stands for truss driver. The truss driver was designed by Ojo to install this proprietary system and it drills anchors into the ground to support the solar panels. At the same time we built these machines, we partnered with Huta to build the TD3 version of the TD2 machines. We yeah. moved into the TD3-2 machines and we have 53 of them working out in the field right now. Here's a warehouse. This is where we have parts for TD2 machines and our TD3 series, TD3-1, TD3-2. This goes down to a job that we have running right now in Las Vegas, Nevada. It's one of the biggest solar fields in the United States. They need power down in Las Vegas to power Las Vegas. Uh, we got Arizona, California, I think part of Colorado uh, they use power for. And I think this is going to um, help out with the uh, energy crisis down there. It will have 1.8 million solar panels across 6,500 acres with about 244,000 trusses. And it will offer a one gigawatt of power when it's in operation. Pre-Ojo days, they have a, a machine that pounds the post in the ground, but in Las Vegas, the ground is so hard that the H-style posts are not able to be pounded into the ground. So it takes three different machines to do this job and it's just super inefficient. So Ojo came up with this idea of a machine called a truss driver. It's an all-in-one machine. It puts the anchors in the ground, it drills it, pre-drills it, and then puts the anchor in the ground and we can move truss to truss within uh, four to six minutes per truss. With the truss driver, you got two operators now doing the job of what was six operators. It's just way more efficient, they can move faster, and, and you know, we're in the worst possible elements, the hardest ground, the most hottest weather in the United States. designed the TD2 machines, and now we're on to making TD3.2 machines. The future is looking really good. We're becoming well-known in the solar industry. <laughs>